hi everybody welcome to Massey's empire channel and thank you for clicking in thank you i truly appreciate today is another day that i'm taking you to nakuru through the abadeas road yes we are going to take an alternative road to nakuru If you're watching this from outside Kenya, you'll probably be asking me, where is Nakuru? Nakuru is a county in Kenya. It is also a city that sits on the Rift Valley. This is the main road that takes you from Nairobi to Kampala, just straight like this. And today is the day that I'm taking you off this road towards the Abadea using the flyover junction. As we are approaching the flyover diversion, I'm super excited to take me with you watching the horizon of the Abadea Hills. Let's go! Join the ride guys, buckle up as I always say, enjoy the views, let me enlighten you about Kenyan roads. As we approach the big cities, the lanes are many and the roads are very wide. But when we approach the small towns and the villages, the lanes change to be one lane.
I believe you are enjoying the road. Now we start getting the views of the Abadea Hills. It's a range of hills that are rim on the Rift Valley. On top of the Abadea Hills, it's 4,001 meters above the sea level. You can tell it is so cold. And also, we have a national park at the Abadea in the Abadeas National Park, we get to view the Big Fives of Kenya. Do you know what the Big Five animals are? This is to tell you it's one of the tourist attraction points in Kenya. Watching the Abadeas horizon and the views. There are also lakes, rivers and waterfalls. But today, I'm not going to take you to the waterfalls or any national park. I'm just gonna take you through this road towards Nakuru. Enjoy the view. long time ago this road was a mud road but it was upgraded in the year 2004 by the president of kenya his excellence mwai kibaki president by then on this road you can never miss the excavator trucks repairing roads but I would say if the Ministry of Road would make this road concrete or the road that has drainage on the side, then it will be a long lasting road. This is a hot, cold, hot, cold weather that is breaking the road every time they need to repair. Side road gutters also would help on this kind of road.
guys i love discovering new roads and i do that when i'm using the google maps on the road this is my addiction google maps now you know the google map was showing me beyond the abadea hills you will have to connect the road that takes you from nyahururu to nyeri i bet that is the highway that also takes you to nakuru If you're from this area, kindly let me know if I'm right or am I wrong. But I guess the Google is right. I am a nature lover. I love it when I see these kind of views. The blue skies, the clouds, the hills, the forest, and the road that has no traffic. I love these guys. I love this.
the views of up close with the abadea ranges was priceless i kept on telling the driver could you please slow down could you open the window could i view this side there was a moment that i felt my camera wasn't doing justice on the view next time i'm to use this road i pray that i'll be having a very powerful pixel camera that will help me zoom in and out as you all know i love views i love giving you the zooming in and the zooming out i pray next time that i'm using this road i'll have a very powerful camera For a moment, I felt like I'm in a mini Switzerland, guys. I loved Switzerland views.
some batter in your brain. Uh, that's why to say, fake it till you make it, eh? And if you play that game, then you just might make a change. Rearrange all the bad to okay. Take the worst I say and turn them to a game. Take the best I say and put them on display. On repeat in your brain till you're feeling no more pain. Uh, never slow yourself down, you can do some more. Push past all the pain and you'll find a door. Open it up and finally explore everything that you thought you could never do before. The right turn road takes you to Nyahururu, Mararan, and Isiolo. Even when you feel low, you can still go. Even when you feel slow, you can still go. Even when there's no hope, you can still go. I never answered a no, man, I still go. I would love to try that being carried on a donkey standing on a cart. <laughs> Thank you guys for taking the ride with me and if you have watched it this far congratulations and thank you so much 
I truly appreciate you. On a later date, I'll give you the continuation of this road towards Eldoret. I hope I don't give you a boring trip. I thank you everyone for watching, even though the video is too long. As I'm signing out, I'm kindly asking you to drop a sweet comment, share this video, give it a thumbs up. Bye bye. See you on my next video.